Hey guys, how are you doing today? All right, so I was watching uh, Star Wars Rebels and I was watching season two, episode four, and uh, that's called Relics of the Old Republic. And we get to see some old clones there. And so, uh, but, but you know, I'm talking about stuff that's in the background, little details, especially the Arabesh um, alphabet. So um, let's go right to it and uh, we'll go to the first one that I noticed. I noticed that when uh, Commander Wolf was talking behind him, there was a screen with some uh, pretty large Arabic letters on it. And there were four of them I could read, N, D, B, Y, and I'm assuming that's a paused screen that says, stand by. Uh, exciting stuff, I know. So uh, also in that scene, he was, um, when he was talking, there was a, a, a screen over here, which I thought was interesting because it looks like it's backward. Uh, I noticed that the, uh, the VI symbol that's um, Arabesh for E is actually IV, so I noticed that was switched. And then the upside down T for T. So, um, so when you zoom in on that, let's see, I think I have a, a pretty a close up of that. So if you read it from right to left, it says parameter, P-A-R-A-M-E-T-E-R. -E -E if you read it left to right, it's kind of nonsense. So this screen must be rotating or we're looking at the back of it. And that was pretty cool, I thought. But then what was really cool is I saw a, um, a symbol that I had never seen before. And so when um, Commander Wolf is talking to Agent Callus in the background on the uh, wall behind him, there's this symbol and it has like a sun on it maybe and then this way up arrow and it looks like a cargo company and what it says is O-U-T-E-R outer R-I-M rim supply company C-O. So outer rim supply company was a first for me. I thought that was pretty nifty actually. And um, finally the one thing in this episode that does have to do with Arabesh a bit uh, they also have numbers. So on, um, so this Arabesh number here uh, on uh, the shoulder armor here, which we can debate on what that piece of armor is called if you really want to. Some might call it a pauldron. Uh, other people uh, call it um, something else. But anyway, there to me that looks like the number five. And if you um, realize that um, they talk about Spectre One, Spectre Two, Spectre Three, so uh, Sabine Wren is designated as Spectre 5. So it makes sense that she would have a 5 stylized on her, uh, you know, because she likes to paint on her uh, uniform. So she's number 5. And uh, yeah, so I thought that was pretty cool. So if anybody has any comments, you can put them in the uh, you know, comment section below. And please subscribe to the channel because that really helps me. And uh, if you like these videos, tell me and I'll make more because. I don't know. It's kind of fun checking out the details in these episodes. They really put a lot of stuff in. All right. Have a great day. See if you can help someone, and uh, I'll see you next time.